Now, the ABC 10 News Pinpoint Weather Super 7-Day Forecast. And happy Thursday, everyone. As we kick things off with our satellite and radar composite, we have very different activity when you compare LA and Orange County to San Diego County. Right now, LA parts of the 405 5 getting absolutely pounded with rain and mountain snow in those much higher elevations. Meanwhile, a little closer to home, we are looking at pretty much all dry conditions, with the exception of some scattered showers along the 15 in the North County from Valley Center to Escondido and then through uh, the Alpine along the 8 freeway. And that's pretty much going to be the story for for the bulk of the morning doesn't mean we're not going to get rain. I'll show you in just a moment when the likelihood of light to moderate rain uh, enters our county. But for now, again, we are dealing with dry conditions and pretty mild in some areas as well. So right now we're waking up to the mid 50s from Oceanside to the Del Mar area. Meanwhile, low 50s in spots like La Jolla and IB and a lot more cooler 50 degrees currently in Escondido and in El Cajon and still hanging out in the 30s in those mountain communities. Coastal highs today are going to top out in the low 60s. As I mentioned, we will continue to see very scattered showers. We're talking about uh, some areas not seeing an ounce of rain, but the more north you travel, including Oceanside, Escondido. That's where you could run into pockets of heavy rain at times. The activity really picks up as we look ahead to the hours of 2, 3, 4 p.m. and then really decreases as we look ahead to your overnight hours into your Friday morning. As we zoom on into your New Year's Eve forecast, again, most of us will be dry, but we're not ruling out the chance of possible showers towards the late afternoon into the evening time. But again, very light as far as amounts go. We're talking about a hundredth anywhere from about a tenth of an inch that will accumulate. So as we look ahead to the weekend, we are going to see much more clear, dry conditions, pleasant conditions, and it looks like Sunday is going to be our warmest day of the seven day outlook. As we take a look at the inland highs, we'll hang out in the 60s today. And as we give you a brief look at the hour by hour forecast along the inland valleys, again, we'll start off cool, but we're slowly progressing to the mid to upper 50s, topping out in the low 60s along some of those warmer inland valleys, including Poway and in Escondido. As we zoom on into your Saturday forecast for your New Year's Day, some of those inland valleys will hang out. Most of us in the low 60s, 62 though in spots like Al Cajon. And then as we zoom on into Sunday's forecast, again, we'll be warmer looking ahead to Sunday. That'll be the warmest day of our seven day outlook, but we'll still be very below average for this time of the year. We're talking about a five to seven degree difference in comparison to what we're used to seeing, which is uh, pretty much close to 70 degrees from Escondido all the way to Ramona. But yeah, most of us will be hanging out in the low 60s, looking ahead to the latter part of your New Year's weekend. And then as we take a look ahead to the start of your first full work week of 2022, we are looking at gorgeous, pleasant conditions, still really mild and cool in some spots. Meanwhile, mountain areas, uh, today we will top out in the low 40s by the weekend. Plenty of sunshine, but we do remain pretty cool through the overnight hours. So Saturday looking at freezing temperatures and then we get progressively warm as we look ahead to the next uh, few days after that. Desert highs in the 60s with a chance of rain, but we dry out looking ahead to tomorrow afternoon. Jim.